so here we are it's 602 in the morning in the morning wednesday the 25th of april 26 26th of april <laughs> and we're on our way on the road again just i just can't, can't wait, wait to, to get, get on, on that road, road again. again and we're off to scotland on the nc 500 Very excited. Yay, our first big road trip. Big road trip. Look at their lovely van. Good morning, campers. How are you? Good, are you? Yeah. Uh, Mark. <laughs> <laughs> so, this is where it starts. The M5. Here we go. Hit the, the road, Jack. Don't, don't you come, come back, back no more, no more, no more, no more, no more. No more. Hit the road, Jack, and don't, don't you come, come back no more. more. Right, 380 miles, and we'll be at St Andrews for the first night. The campsite, fourth house, and that's it. Is, that, is that the first of fourth? That's the first of four, four for the <laughs> See ya in 380 miles. We'll see ya when we get a bit further. We're off in a motor car, 60 coppers are after us and we don't know where we are. We're off, we're off, we're off in a motor car, 60 coppers are after us and we don't know where we are. Yay, there we go, there's our little house for the next two weeks, yay. So, we are now, where are we, Will? On our way to Carlisle, yes. but I can't say exactly what spot. 93 miles until Carlisle. But what we just wanted to say was the forecast for the next two weeks has been absolutely horrendous. And we're just on our way up now and it's absolutely glorious sunshine. So what I wanted to say is if it all goes tits up and it's a nightmare, we started off in the sunshine. Bakers just overtook us. We're just in the South Lakes. It's getting really pretty now. And look, the sky's still blue and the sun's still shining. nice to find 
finally be at our first destination. It's been a long day. We're all tired. How many miles have we driven today, Will? We have done 364. 364 miles. So, here we go. Oh, look at the view. That's the sea. Oh, may look. There's people. There's people there sunbathing, look. <laughs> so the pictures have all got names by the look of it. This is nice, isn't it? There we are. So that's us just parked. Here's Mark and Joe coming in behind us. They're going on that pitch there. There's the sea. The sun's in the sky. Oh, engines off. Do you want to go on? That's our first night done. We've not officially started the NC500 yet. We're just uh, south of St Andrews. It's the fourth of four, fourth of fourth in the distance, or fourth of five, whatever you want to call it. Lovely little campsite called Fourth House Campsite. Got a bit of the sun's just trying to break through. Elaine says that was our view for the evening, looking out into that. She can't really see because it's still a bit misty. But now we're going to drive through Aviemore and up to Inverness and stay just north of Inverness tonight at a place called Fortros. That's what we're doing, isn't it? Shannery Point, I mean, dolphin spotting. We're going to try and look for some dolphins. Well, we saw them last time we went, didn't we? Yep, we did. So that was a lovely little sight. And the van's all ready for us to depart again. So we're just coming into Shannery Point now at Fortrose Bay. It's beautiful, we love it here. What a shame it's raining though, because this is where we're dolphin spotted. <laughs> and we did see lots last time we were here. Stunning. And here we come down into the campsite. Fortress Bay. Oh, it's such a shame it's raining. Because look how close we are to the water's edge. Amazing. So this is us. We've just reversed onto our pitch and look how close to the sea we are. Such a shame it's raining. I know I keep saying that, but can you imagine how beautiful that would look with the blue sky, the yellow flowers, the blue sea? It's just stunning. And there's Mark and Joe, some other campers and ours. How beautiful is this? Yellow, I think it's bracken, yellow bracken as far as the eye can see. It goes on and on and on. There's the old folk I'm with. <laughs> We're walking by the sea. We're at Channery Point. The weather's not great. But we're heading out to see the dolphins. We saw lots last time we were here. Apparently this is the best time of the day to see them. So that's where we're off to. parked up at Fortros campsite just uh, about half a mile down from Shannery Point we had a walk in the rain do a bit of uh, dolphin watching we were lucky to see some weren't we and now we're just uh, they were breaching yes now we're just having a nice uh, Greek salad in the van watching the mist and the rain getting ready for bed and then tomorrow we head up the east coast and uh, we'll see how tomorrow goes see you later the van parked up at Fortros Bay campsite, Shannery Point, just over in the distance. 
and that's the view that we woke up to this morning not too shabby two nights done let's get on the NC500 proper now see you in a shortly in a shortly what's all that about that's what we're on day three where are we going today Will? the final destination is just left of John O'Groats to Dunnett Head but now we're on our way to the Mermaid of the North join in the NC500 so I'm just going to turn the camera around just to do a little video of where we are now it's lovely We found the mermaid of the north. She's actually 11 foot high, but doesn't look it. And there's Mark and Joe and Will. It's very quiet, it's lovely. It's worth a stop. Little view of Dunrobin Castle and we're going to move on now to Brora Beach. There's the rest of the gang. So this is Brora Beach. Gosh, I guess on a lovely sunny day this is exactly the kind of place you want to be. tiny but it's lovely this is Brora right on the edge of a golf course We've just stopped at the River Bobby Tea Room, which has got really good ratings on the internet. Everybody talks about it on Facebook. Look here. There's the van, we just parked up. Laffer or Loffer, Loffer on wheel. Harbour. It's absolutely stunning. 
So peaceful and quiet. There's me taking a video of Elaine taking a video. Walk that this way. I might go to that cave over there. I've just realised I can't go to that cave over there because I've got to get across the river. <laughs> I don't think I'll try that today. <laughs> We're just on the way to John Groats and right in front of us there is the Orkney Isles. It's fun. Can't believe we're here, can we Will? No, top of the country.
too shabby for tonight, I'd say. What do you reckon? So, this could be our little park for tonight. Oh, the battery's about to go.